Welcome to the Blissful Blog. Today is April 16, 2020, and our story for today is fulfillment in leadership. In the Philippines, every barangay or village is led by a village captain and seven councillors. These officials are elected and serve as a basic government unit in the village. They plan and implement government policies, make local and community programs and projects, as well as keeping every resident safe. There is a youth version of this position which is called the Youth Council. This is led by the Youth Council Chairman and the seven youth councillors. Their projects are mainly for the benefit of the youth in the village. When our scholar, Melanie, was in her senior year in college, she was encouraged to run for office as a youth councillor. She was hesitant at first. However, her interest in trying something new and serving other people took over. She won as the first counselor and had then supported the youth chairman's projects. She liked being a counselor. She loved supporting the chairman. What happened next was something she did not expect. The youth chairman had to leave his position to focus on his career. Being the first counselor meant she was first in line to take over the youth chairman's position. She was terrified and didn't feel she was ready for it. With her parents and her fellow counselors' encouragement, and again, her interest in trying something new and helping others made her decide to fully commit as the new youth council chairman of Barangay Turak, San Carlos City. She had then continued and started multiple programs in the village, sports league, to help prevent the focus on drug use, alcohol, and gambling in youth, multiple workshops such as AIDS prevention, coping with depression, and computer literacy. Amidst the COVID-19 pandemic and all of the events canceled, her team decided to repurpose their funds to give relief goods to the residents of their village. This experience helped her to become more confident in herself. She discovered joy and fulfillment, seeing smiles from the people who they helped through her leadership. The main takeaways she learned from this experience are take the leap and believe in yourself and to never lose sight of love for helping others even if your actions are not seen nor appreciated. We are very proud of you, Melanie and your counselors at Barangay Turak. Keep up the good work, stay safe, and we appreciate all of your efforts. Until then, stay blissful everyone!